Tonight on Real True Global Hunting, we're in the Staffordshire countryside for the opening day of duck season with Service UK's Owen Beardsmore. <laughs> Today is the opening day of duck season in the UK and for some it's a day to look forward to all summer. Owen Beardsmore of Service UK is a favourite of ours here at Team Wild TV and over the last three years we've been hunting with him all over the UK and in Europe. Owen's known for his deer management and stalking with access to some of the most amazing estates and land in the UK. We've been stalking with him for Munjak, Roe, Seeker, Reds and Fallow on home soil. And the team here have been over to Prague with Owen and friends to take part in their annual Christmas driven hunts. This time last year, we were out with Owen on his first day of duck season. He had kindly invited Realtree's Nolan Sweet and myself down to his local duck pond to shoot. And, as always, Rip was on hand with fresh made burgers. It's late afternoon and um, I'm meeting with some friends here. Um, we're going down to one of my ponds I've got. And we've got some rear duck on there, um, but the amount of food we've been putting in, we've got a lot of wild ducks coming. This, at, at the moment, they're turning in all the stubble fields, so the ducks are now hunting for food. We're feeding lots of food at the moment, so we're getting plenty of wild mallard and, uh, and tufted duck. I love this time of the year. Um, I finished with my row books. The roots finished about two weeks ago, and um, that's, all, that's my stalking. And, uh, but my hobby, uh, I really love to go out shooting birds, in particular ducks is what I really like. Uh, tonight I've got some mates coming down and fingers crossed we're going to have a good night. I really love duck shooting, uh, they're truly wild ducks while they're coming into us and it, they produce really challenging shots. They can drop in over the top or from the sides, first, at first or last light, it's really great to shoot them. The guys get geared up away from the pond and then head in ready to go. As soon as they arrive, the ducks would get up so they need to be ready. Owen formulates a plan and everybody gets into the position. There's plenty on the pond and everyone's ready. Rip fires at one and a group take to the skies. have a pick up after the first drive and there's a few ducks down. Okay we've uh, we just flushed the uh, ducks off and everybody's had a shot so now we're going to get everybody in the hides and sit and wait till it's dark and see what comes back in. There's already ducks about in the air and uh, it's looking all looking good so see how we get on. With the ducks having got up and off of the pond the guys get the decoys set as they wait for them to come back in. As the guys wait, the sun begins to fade into the sky. At last light, the dogs begin to head back into the pond.
as the sun sets, the hunt is over and it's time for a count up. We've picked and chosen birds. Um, there's a lot of young ones on the pool still, um, but we've got a, a reasonable bag. These will be going off to the game dealers. Everybody's shot really well. Uh, you enjoyed yourself, Ian? I had a wonderful night, although I didn't shoot particularly well. I did make a lot of noise. Uh, but no, it's been a phenomenal evening and the, the weather's been great, the company's yeah. been great. Yeah. And it's so exciting to get out that first night of the season. Nice you know, cup of tea in the duck yard and a well, hot I, sausage. I didn't, I didn't get my tea, but I did get my <laughs> sausage, which I was very, very pleased about. So, so no, it's, you've got a phenomenal setup here, a lovely bit of water, yeah. it's, it's beautiful countryside. And, and even if the birds didn't come in, we still had a water. Yeah, we had the geese, didn't we? we? In the background, we could hear them, but they were off going on the stubbles. Else, yeah. They were in last night, but uh, that's duck shooting and we goose got, shooting got for the you. decoys out. Yeah. But they were just a couple of fields over. Yeah, so they, maybe no, they knew where they were going. So I think there's some bean fields been cut over the back. So we're. And you can uh, hear the, the, the mower in the background as well. Yeah. So. Uh, it's, it's still, what sort of time of year is best, really, for, for the duck shooting? Well, on, for this pool in particular, um, December, January, um, when they really are hunting for food, we get uh, there's, there's a big reservoir about three or four miles away, mm. uh, and we get a lot of duck, widgeon, teal. Uh, we've got a tufted here tonight. Um, but our staple is our mallard. Uh, we, d we release some ducks uh, to supplement what's being shot um, from the wild stock, but um, it's yeah, Je December, January is really the time for us. And you know, it's, it's late afternoon, it's bitterly cold, and they want to get in. You know, tonight it's been a reasonably nice evening, lovely sunset, wasn't yeah. it? And uh, it's been really it's good, very so. romantic. Yeah, <laughs> so thank you very much indeed. No problem, been great to see you back. Duck shooting never disappoints and it's been another fantastic outing with Service UK and Owen Beardsmore. To find out more about Service UK and the range of hunting adventures they provide, visit their website. Subscribe to TMR TV for all the best hunting videos on YouTube and to stay up to date with our new range of shows for 2015.